Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're gonna learn about how to watch TV channels on a monitor via decoder. Now, first of all, we require three major things. One being our radio external plug, which receives radio signals from the receiver. Secondly, we have our monitor here, and uh, the purpose is to display the TV channels. Thirdly, we have a decoder. The purpose of all these equipments, we're gonna understand them one by one. A reason as to why one requires the other. First of all, we have our monitor here. Our monitor, unfortunately, does not have a place where it can accommodate. Bit our aerial plug here, as you can see from our monitor here, monitor ports here. We only have our DVI port, a VGA port, and a USB port. Now that being the case, this brings us to the reason or the necessity or to bring in our that device being uh, our decoder here as you can see it it has got an external socket that is uh, noted noted by RFE our external socket can accommodate the aerial plug uh, we've got two different devices that differ one another in terms of the principle of our RFE one we got a uh, we got a monitor two we got a uh, decoder now another thing that we differ one another in terms of the principle of operation is that our monitor here serves as an encoder. An encoder is any device that converts analog signals into digital signals. Now, that being the case, our monitor here, as we said earlier, has been ruled out. Now, on the second occasion, simply because in the first place, it did not have a port where we can insert our external uh, area plug. Secondly, it being our monitor being an encoder, and as you see, the a decoder is any device that can convert analog signals into digital signals. The signals that we get from the AV plug here are in form of digital. So automatically, we ought to go for a second option. Uh, second option or alternative in this case is a decoder. A decoder simply because a decoder is any device that converts digital signals into analog signals. So. We got our input here for the area plug here. So the digital signals from our area plug are, are received by our decoder here. Then the digital signals are converted by the decoder into analog signals. But unfortunately, guys, our decoder here does not have our an output which is in form of analog simply because the only output we have here is a HDMI output and HDMI output now that is a high definition uh, multimedia interface and in form of digital so what we do barrier simply because guys if you recall very well our monitor here had a VGA port, the DVI port. Now, a VGA port is normally used uh, to receive uh, signals from the desktop uh, computer. Normally, you use it for that purpose. But in our case, yeah, let me say this that any device that has got a VGA port can only receive analog signals. So, ruling in our case, our uh, decoder here cannot uh, be infused directly with our monitor here so we got to, we got to look for another device or something else that can help us uh, convert the digital signals in our decoder to analog signals that can be received by our monitor uh -huh. here comes our plan c now our plan c here is a hdmi converter which entails a hdmi connector a hdmi cable and here this is our hdmi to vga converter now if you look closely we got our vga port there now this goes for around to around eight dollars to ten dollars it depends with the market pricing then here with me i got a vga to vga cable is gonna help me connect this VG, uh, VG, HDMI converter to my VGA cable and then from there sorry then from there let me connect my HDMI cable to the decoder 
to serve a complete decoding process. The digital signals enters the recorder. Then they are used in form of digital signals. I use my HDMI converter. This is the HDMI converter. Then the signals here are transmitted in form of analog signals, which of which the VGA cable I will connect it to my monitor near the back so that the complete decoding process can take place. The monitor then from that point will receive the analog signals and convert them to digital signals which will be released in form which will appear in the, uh, the display. With everything connected as you can see, starting from my monitor where the VGA cable all the way uh, through my HDMI VGA converter to my set of box that is my decoder. Let's see if uh, everything works. Let's see whether if everything works. Uh -huh. Let's see if everything works. I uh -huh. can see the decoder booting on. Here we go. Finally, guys, we made it. Please subscribe my YouTube channel for more videos. Thank you for watching and have a blessed time. Thanks.